All right, muscle fiber contraction. Muscle fiber contraction is the process in which a muscle is pulled inward in a tightening way, such as when you flex your arms. To start this, the distal end of a motor neuron releases acetylcholine. This acetylcholine then diffuses across the gap at the neuromuscular junction. While this happens, the sarcolemma is stimulated and sends a muscle impulse over the surface of the muscle fiber and deep within the fiber. This continues to travel through the transverse tubules until it reaches the sarcoplasmic reticulum. Next, calcium ions diffuse from the sarcoplasmic reticulum and enter the fiber through the transverse tubules. Tropomyosin molecules then move and open up specific sites on the actin filaments. The actin and myosin then form linkages with each other. The actin filaments are pulled inward by the myosin cross bridges. As the actin is pulled inward, the muscle fiber shortens and the muscle becomes contracted. Right. Muscle fiber relaxation. Muscle fiber relaxation is the opposite of contraction, spreading the fiber back out into a less tense state. To start, the acetylcholine esterase decomposes the acetylcholine, and the muscle fiber membrane halts being stimulated. The calcium ions then are actively transported into the sarcoplasmic reticulum, and ATP causes the linkages between actin and myosin to break. The cross bridges then reposition. Troponin and tropomyosin molecules inhibit the interaction between myosin and actin filaments. Muscle fiber then remains relaxed, but they are prepared and ready to become stimulated and contract again. And